and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, my name is Quinn. Um, today's video, I'm going to be doing a thrift store haul and I'm super, super excited to show you guys what I got. I have not done this before ever. Um, I used to be one of those people that was really anti like ever going into a Goodwill or Value Village. Um, I think just the smells really freaked me out in there. I was really sensitive to that and I'm kind of a germaphobe so um, I would really hate touching things in there unless I like had hand sanitizer right away. So um, it kind of sounds like I'm a drama queen or like a snob but I promise you guys I'm not because I bought so much stuff and I absolutely am obsessed with Goodwill. I go there and get books all the time. I absolutely love it. I got over my germ fear <laughs> and I got over the smells. Um, but I cannot wait to show you guys what I got. I went to um, Value Village and Goodwill for this haul. Um, if you guys don't have a Value Village near you, I'm not sure if they're only a West Coast thing or not, but we have them here in Washington State and they're generally a lot cleaner and nicer than Goodwill's. So, and the Kohl's are generally a lot nicer too. Um, I've never found an item there that has any stains on it or anything like that and they're a lot, usually less worn. Um, so I really loved it and I have so many great things to show you guys. I have this whole pile, um, and I also have a whole bag down here. So I can't wait to show you guys. Make sure you stay tuned to see what I got. Um, subscribe if you guys haven't already and make sure to let me know in the comments your guys' favorite item that I show you guys and, um, your favorite store to go thrifting at. Cause I would love to see where you guys go and to go try some new places. So without further ado, let's get started. So we're gonna start with my Value Village items first, but um, first I wanna say the prices that I got everything at were a super unique situation. So I went during Memorial Day weekend, um, and if you guys didn't know, all of their clothes are 50% off for the whole weekend, which is insane. Um, I stumbled across this accidentally. I went to Goodwill the day before the sale just to drop off some donations and then just kind of want to look at books and things. Um, and then we saw the signs and I begged my husband to let me go back the next day to look. So I ended up leaving Goodwill with a giant bag. Um, and then the next day I went back to Value Village with my neighbor because the sale was still going on and she was the one who told me how great Value Village is and um, how much better it is than Goodwill. And so when I went there, I had to hold myself back because I had already bought a ton of stuff from Goodwill the day before and my husband would kill me. So I only got a few things from Value Village, but we'll start there. Um, the first thing that I got is this super stinking cute flannel. Um, it is blue and it has cream and red in it. It's, it like really just looks like a nice flannel you'd get from like, I don't know, American Eagle or something like that, but it is so nice. And I will show you guys all of these on too. Um, this was originally $7.99, but I got it for half off, um, half off of that price. So eh, a little under $4. Um, but it is from the brand Universal Thread Goods Company, um, which I've never heard of, but it is a size small. And it was normally $20 um, through that company. So I got this for like four bucks. So such a good deal. And it's brand new. It has a tag, um, which is amazing. So the next item I got is this top. And it is the Morona brand. So um, I, I believe that's from Target. But it is normally, it was normally $5. And then I got it for 50% off. So like just under $3 and it's a size small and it is so cute. Um, I don't know what you call this pattern, but there's a close up of it and it has this really awesome like faux leather detail on the collar. Um, and it's just this cute little top that I thought would be really cute to wear like to church or to dress up with um, some skinny jeans and some heels or some black booties. So I loved this for only $2.50. I was like, well, might as well, right? And it looks way cuter on than it does just holding it up. I loved that one. So the next item I got from Value Village is a sweater. And this was normally $4, so I got it for two bucks, which is a pretty dang good deal. And this is also from Target. It's a size medium. And it is one of those more tight-fitted gray 
sweaters. Um, and I really just needed some new sweaters for winter. Um, I have a few from Old Navy, but they're like so big, like they're the scoop neck. They're so big that like they fall off my shoulders and you can see my bra and I really just needed some like fitted ones. So I grabbed this one for two bucks and it is just perfect and I can't wait to try this one. So the last item I got from Value Village is literally such a shocker. It is the brand Zella, which I don't know if I'm saying that right. Zella, Zilla, Zella, I don't know. But this is like that workout brand that you can find at Nordstrom, which is like, I think it's pretty pricey. I've never really looked at the prices because um, I know I was turned off like a few years ago when I looked at prices. So ever since then, I haven't looked again, but it is normally $10. And then I got it for five at Value Village. And it is this super cute workout hoodie or just a normal hoodie to wear. Um, it reminds me a lot of Lululemon and I love Lululemon jackets like those Lululemon is one of the only brands that I will ever pay full price for because the quality really truly is amazing and is the only workout gear that has lasted me years and years and years without pilling and just falling apart. So um, this is a lot like it and I absolutely love it. The only problem was the zipper is broken at the bottom. It still zips all the way. So if I have to just pull it on over my head, then that's not that big of a deal for a $5 really nice jacket. So and I could probably get that fixed. Um, I'll just have to figure it out. But this was what I got from Value Village. And I think that total was somewhere around like $14 or $15. So to get all of that for only that amount is pretty dang good. Um, I used to shop at Marshalls and TJ Maxx at the time because I'm such a... Uh, I'm just more frugal with my spending. Um, I don't like to spend a lot of money on clothes because I know I'm going to go through them pretty quick um, to keep up with styles and trends. And so um, normally to pay $14 to $16 for a top for Marshalls was like a good deal for me. But I just got all of that for like the same price as one top. So I feel pretty good about it, that. And that's what I got from Value Village. So next I'm going to show you guys what I got from Goodwill. Okay, so the night that I went to Goodwill, before I knew they were having their 50% off, I did find a few things that I just had to get and I did not want to risk losing them. So the first one um, is this really cute sweater dress. Um, I bought it for $7.99 and it is this amazing green and black and it has this great, like kind of like an Aztec pattern um, and it is long sleeve, it has a scoop neck and it is literally so stinking cute um i don't think i told you guys this but for our honeymoon justin and i planned a trip to whistler canada and we're going at the end of november so it's gonna be snowy and cold and just so perfect um so i got this to wear on like a date night with some leggings and some boots um and i'm really excited for that uh, and then the second thing that i got that night um before the sale was a Ralph Lauren turtleneck. You guys, Ralph Lauren stuff is expensive. So I like freaked out when I saw this. Um, it's a size large, so it is definitely too big for me, but I figured I'd just wear it as kind of like a oversized turtleneck with some leggings and I think it'll be super cute. So I got it for $5.99, $5.99 for Ralph Lauren turtleneck. Um, it is literally so stinking cute. It looks just like a basic turtleneck right here, but um, I'll show you guys when I try it on how stinking cute it is on. I absolutely love it. Um, it literally looks so good with tight skinny jeans um, or with leggings. So I can't wait to show you guys this one. Um, so next, this is everything I got during the 50% off sale. So the first item, I got this um, literally just for Whistler. I will probably wear it all winter long though. Um, it was originally $7.99, so I got it for roughly around four bucks. Um, and it is this super cute black and white vest with a gold zipper. Um, it is so cute. I, I don't even know like how to describe this pattern, but it kind of has like this quilted texture to it also. It's from the brand SJ, um, which I don't even know what that is but it literally looks like it's never been worn. 
Um, it's in amazing condition. There's no stains, nothing on it. it. It's so cute. So I can't wait to wear this with um, like a hoodie and just throw this on over for Whistler. I think it's going to be perfect. So that was such a good steal. Um, I also found this really surprisingly cute top. I thought it was so cute when I saw it on the hanger, but I was a little confused if it would look good on me, if it might look a little boxy. So it's a small and this is, it was originally $5.99. So about three bucks is what I paid. And it is this super cute long sleeve v-neck white, kind of like a ruffled top. Um, I can't wait to show you guys what it looks like on because I feel like when I was looking at it, I was like, eh, I'm not really sure if I could pull that off, but it is seriously so cute on and I can't wait to dress this up with some booties and some tight jeans. Um, next I got a plain just denim button up, which I have been wanting for like six years now. I don't even know how long, but I wanted one of these forever because I have so many flannels, but no, just plain like denim corduroy ones, not corduroy. I don't know what it's called. <laughs> But this was originally $5.99 and I paid about three bucks. Um, and this is a size small. And this is from Old Navy, which I can't even believe. So it's just a button up. It literally looks brand new, you guys. Like none of these, none of the clothes I picked out have stains. They look like they were barely worn. So $3 from Old Navy. So something like this would probably normally be around 35 bucks. So this was a huge, huge steal, huge win. Can't wait for that. The next item, oh my gosh, I totally forgot that I got this. Totally forgot. So um, this is originally $7.99, so I got it for basically four bucks. And it's from Forever 21, and it is a size large sweater. So I got this to wear as an oversized sweater. I'm normally a small to a medium, so this is literally gonna just be an oversized sweater with leggings. Um, probably throw my vest on over this and it'll be so, so stinking cute. Um, and sweaters like this, it's hard to ever tell if they've been worn because they already kind of have a worn look. Um, and they're kind of just meant to be like fun, loose and baggy. So, um, I'm really excited about this. Such a good steal. And then the next item, if you guys noticed a theme, I got a lot of sweaters for Whistler and for the winter but this next item was $5.99 got it for about three bucks and it's from Old Navy it's another sweater and it is just this plain white sweater it's a medium so I thought this would look so cute with that vest over the top with some leggings and some boots and I think it'll just be so cute and nice um, for the winter time and once again it looks like it's barely been worn um, I made sure to not get anything that had pilling on it or anything like that. There were quite a few items that I loved, but you could just tell that they were definitely worn. So I'm really excited about that. Next, I got this cute top from Forever 21. And let's see, it's a size small. It was originally $7.99, so I got it for about four bucks. It's really wrinkly right now, you guys, sorry. But it's this olive green little top um, I've really been in desperate need of some, just some casual, nice tops for church and to dress up. Um, I just have a lot of t-shirts, unfortunately. And so I really need something like this because with this, you can just throw on some jeans and some booties and it's dressed up and it looks cute. So for four bucks, I'll take it. I just need to iron it. <laughs> and then the next item, my t-shirt obsession. I... I think I tried on about 10 plain t-shirts. So this was normally $4.99, got it for about $2.50. This is from Old Navy and it is in the size medium and it is this really cute burgundy, just scoop neck shirt. Um, I just love basic t-shirts like this. I wear these with some jeans and booties to dress it up all the time. So that's like my go-to look. So really good deal, $2 shirt. Um, next, I got another item from Old Navy. I don't know if these all came from the same person or not, but a lot of Old Navy. So $5.99, got this for $3, you guys. How stinking cute is this flannel? Three bucks? I mean, you can't go wrong. I mean, even if I were to have paid 
I mean, for an old navy flannel that looks like it's unworn, I mean, yeah, you can't go wrong. So next, um, next up I got a sweater from Mossimo Supply. Um, and this is from Target. So $5.99 was the original price at Goodwill. And so I got it for about three bucks. Um, and this is just a basic like button up cardigan. Um, the arms are more of a textured material. And then the back is like a softer material. I don't really know how to describe it, but it's just a basic button up cardigan. Once again, just looks like it was like barely worn. Um, and I don't really have any of these, so I've really been wanting one. So that was another good find. I didn't realize I bought so much stuff. Oh my goodness. So the next item is from American Eagle. It was originally $7.99, so got it for about four bucks. And once again, it is a basic button-up cardigan. Um, and it's just like a light gray. So it's really cute. It's gonna, it was a little bit big on me, but I think it'll be really cute still. Um, and I think this is the only item I got that does look a little bit more worn than anything else. It still doesn't really look that worn at all. Um, so I'm really excited to wear that to church and to dress up. And then the last item that I got um, is this huge coat. <laughs> It's from the Morona brand, so from Target. It was originally $14.99, so I got it for seven bucks. Pretty good deal. It's a medium. So it's like, I don't know what you call these coats. I'm really so not into fashion, you guys. I'm so sorry that I don't know names of anything, but it's just this really cute coat that buttons in the front and zips. So there's buttons, I can't even. You guys will see when I try it on to show you, but it also ties around the waist. So it's really, really stinking cute. Um, and it's really heavy and warm. And you guys, it literally is not worn. Like it has this like fleece material on the inside and it literally feels like brand new. Like it feels like it's never been washed or anything. So I'm like blown away by this. Like it still has the spare button in here and everything. So clearly someone never wore it but I'm really excited about it and I think it's gonna be so cute in Whistler um, and just to wear all winter long. So that is what I got from Goodwill um, and I will show you guys what they look like on. I'm looking back on a time and we just couldn't get it right I wish somebody would have told me That everything would change I'm finally seeing it clear And I know just what you are I wish somebody would have told me That the bed feels warmer than it ever did When you were by my side And now I don't have much, but baby Now I got my pride and my stride And my heart side, hey I'm 20, 20 in hindsight And oh yeah, let me down, but I got up all by myself You help me live and learn that I don't need nobody else Hey, through the hot time I'm 20, 20 in hindsight Somebody would have told me that everything would change I'm finally seeing it clear And I know just what you are I wish somebody would have told me yeah. That the bed feels warmer than it ever did when you were by my side And now I don't have much, but baby, now I got my pride And my stride, and my heart side Hey, I'm 20, 20 in hindsight And oh yeah, let me down, but I got up all by myself You help me live and learn that I don't need nobody else Hey, through the hot time I'm 20, 20 in hindsight Oh,
haul. Um, I really hope you guys loved it and I hope you guys like what I got. Please let me know in the comments what your guys' favorite item was that I got um, and let me know your guys' favorite place to go thrifting. I would love to go try some new places um, and if you guys haven't subscribed already please subscribe. Uh, make sure to check out the description box below for my Instagram account and feel free to let me know if you guys have any questions or to just comment whatever you guys want. Um, and welcome to my YouTube channel if you guys are new. Um, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.